We're a small channel and one thing we ask of all of you great viewers, if you haven't subscribed please consider a subscription but equally a like comment will also help the channel grow because it really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Thank you, thank you very much. So today's game I'm rather excited to be playing. So this is the 2019 edition of Sega World Drivers Championship. This is on the Technopara emulator and you know what? It looks mightily fine up and running on a PC and it's incredible the quality of some of these games that you actually have. Because remember, the Technopara type games, essentially you've got a PC running the game and this is what you've got here. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. Now, as we're on the Technopara, not all of you may know how to configure this. Um, I figured what I want to do is just show you basically a couple of things on how to get it up and running so first of all this is the executable that I had how I've got that set up you could take a moment to pause the video and copy the settings from there and we've also got the joystick which is set up this way here feel free to take those settings copy those down and essentially that is how I got this up and running so this game is built on Unity Media or also Unity, I think it is. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit different to what you would usually expect. A lot of it is in Japanese, which is a pain in the neck. It's probably got as much Japanese as Bomber Girl, but you know what? We can figure our way through this. So it wants us to press the start button. Let's do it. Oh, that was a bit loud, was it? That, we're we're going to turn this down. Holy hell, we are going to turn that down. Oh, I hope that's okay. Right, so what I can tell you is. Uh, Okay, that was the wrong button. Hit start again. All I can tell you is this is back, this is forward. So we're just going to go forward here. And we're playing effectively in offline mode with no save card or anything like this. The Techno Power so Emulator right. allows us to do this. And we've got to pick a car. And look at all these cars. We've got 56 seconds. We're going to quickly go through them. But the quality of the graphics that you've got here is really, really good. Pacific with Gotham, Game Duo Drive, Arnage Racing, Saitama Toyota, LM Corsa, R&D Sport, K2's Racing, Cars Tokai Dream, 2018, Hitotsuyama, Team Tyson. So, so many options. Toyota Prius, Auto Panther, Dijon Racing, iCars Bentley, iCar Guy Racing, Team Mach. And that's the one we're going to pick. We'll pick the one at the end. So it starts to carry on, and then obviously the green button goes forward. This is to allow us to have the accelerator controls, I believe, on uh, the, the, the buttons that I've defined here. Otherwise, they could be on the wheel. I think that's what that means. And here we go. Right, so this, I'm not sure what it means. Mode select. Now this is clearly mode select, so there's configuration. Don't know what that is. That's probably car select, actually. And we've got three options here. Time attack, this one, and this one here. So the first one we're going to do is pick well this. Select. And it's a racetrack. So we're going to look at... Uh, let's look at this racetrack Mid here. Special. Mid-ocean special. That sounds pretty, doesn't it? And it should be quite easy because it's only three stars. Fire to start. And then we say okay for that. Have a good race. And I believe, I Magic. hope, off we go. Right, so we are only... Good Lord, it talks so much. We are... In fact, you know what, I'll just talk over it. We are... We are a single player, but I'll turn it down, I'll turn it down. We are a single player here, so we've got to wait for this timer to run out. There's nothing that we can do about this. Um, we're basically racing against, um, you know, AI-type players. And there's a bit of elastic banding that goes on, I think. And you'll see this as we play. What you see on the bottom left is basically speeches that you can do by hitting one of the four buttons to shout at other drivers. True Japanese style. Anyway, here we go. We're ready to go. We are ready to go. Starting grid. Don't worry, there are other cars there. There are other cars there. That's because we are the only human participants. So look at this, how good does this look? Alright, so we've got a couple of views. Bullet view. Uh, start view, car view, uh, 
I think we're going to go to the car view. And it's not that a hard game, it's a rather pretty game. So we've got three laps and we've got to beat uh, ten positions here. Oh, slow down, slow down. Oh, it's tight. Holy hell. So I've played some of the other weight race tracks that are quite wide and I've been waiting for this game. I've been waiting for this game for a very, very long time. This was available on Techno Power for Patreons for ages. Um, but no, it's now come to the general public, so to speak. So you could download the wrong file for this, or rather the, the, the image file um, for this, and play yourself. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Difficulties, difficulties. And, okay, we did get to first position. But now, now we're back in second position. Look at them start overtaking. This is where the elastic banding comes in, I believe. Because, you know, they do get some, like, super zooms at a time. And what's nice, if you get far ahead on these tracks, is you do find yourself in a position where you can basically uh, overtake cars that you've already overtaken. So, you know, that's quite good, especially on some of the larger ones that give you 20 cars that you're against. But no, this is good, 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 solid fun as we go on to lap two. Yeah, the, the graphics, the, the, the graphics are absolutely beautiful for this. They really, really are. We are going to look at the other modes as well um, to see what else we've got. We'll have a look at another track, I think, as well to show you a different track. So it's not just this particular one we're showing you, but this is quite a pretty one at night. Oh, slow down! Oh, we made it. How that says good corners. We clipped the car and hit the corner. But look at that, look at that, how, how quickly they catch up. You haven't got a rear view mirror or anything like that. You can view behind like that, but we're not going to do that too often. Because as you can probably find out for yourselves, you could like, look over your head when you're driving your own car and you find yourself crashing pretty soon. But there's a lot of fireworks going up here as well as we come probably near the end of the second lap. So we might get first place. We might. Oh, look at that, look at that catch up. So you're always struggling with the top three cars. You know, there are a lot of catching up on you, but yeah, we might get by. Oh, close, close, close. We might get by. Okay, oh, there you are, hello. And behind us, there's still one that we quickly show. Okay, where are we on the track? Okay, we're about halfway round. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. All right, somehow we made that, only just. So that apparently there's something called racing lines. If I can keep the racing line, I might be okay. But possibly I can't even see a racing line because it's not shown. We haven't, I don't think there's out a way you can turn it on here. But some racing games give you the racing line to show you where to go. But now we're showing that we are okay on this. And we're playing this on a home PC. This is an arcade game that we are playing on the home PC. Boom, there you go. And it's absolutely glorious. It really, really is. First place. First place. Okay, and all the other drivers, the other ones, should start popping in as well. We do see them popping, at least on some of the other types of races. Let's give them a moment. There they come. All right, so, yes, yes, yes. Let's see what car was the loser. But the cars look so pretty and all the differences on them as well. You know, it just makes you want to play. It really, really does. And there we go. Um, the Audi came last. All you Audi drivers, you've got a poor car. All right, and this shows how we did in the race, you know. We went all the way from 10th to 4th to 2nd to 1st, back to 2nd for a while. Then we stayed at 1st. All right, and we've completed these call to fix that. Obviously, I don't know what this is, but it seems to think that I've got a good driver's skill. So yeah, that's fine by me. All right, so that takes us to a top menu. That exits. We're just going to go here, and we're going to pick another track. Let's go for another track. Where shall we go? Where shall we go? Let's do this. Let's do this one. 
green is okay. Now I can't remember where, whether it's going to want to do this matching, and yes it is. It's a little pain in the ass when it does this. It really is, but you know what? It's a price that's worth paying to play a game that you know you shouldn't be playing on your home PC. And you know, they could probably move this to a PlayStation if they wanted to, or maybe an Xbox or something like that. But no, this is really, really, really a true arcade game. And they do have PCs running them, as I said before. There's a PC dump that is taken. The great people at Techno Power Up, the great coders, designers, and everything else they do, basically have a look, make it run, and you've got this. And there's quite a few other Techno Power games that have come out away from the Patreon status with this new release. So we will be doing them on the channel every once in a while as well. So, and I, I think another one I want to try is Daytona. There's a new version of Daytona, so that's going to be worth giving a look at. But no, here we go, here we go. So another one of these tracks, and what we're going to do when we finish this track, we'll go to the top menu and show you the couple of other options that are there as well. So here we go, here we go. Oh, oh, that was a bit quick. I mean, just look at the detail in these buildings, you know, and everything you've got. You know, I'll stay quiet so you can admire the scenery, I think, for this particular race. But yeah, no, it's pretty, pretty damn cool. And by staying quiet, I do mean staying quiet. I won't be doing one of those usual ones, but yeah, I'm going to stay quiet for this game or something. And I spend ages talking about being quiet without actually being quiet. So yeah, position 19. Let's be quiet for a little bit. And there you go, we finished. So we came number one again, but you can see them all catch up for that period of time where I really do think Rob Bandon is happening. So let's see, start to carry on. Ignore that, and look at that. Once we got first, we really stayed first. Move on, move on. 
And we're going to go to the top menu here, I think, at this particular point. And mode we're going to try this mode. So, professional certification. Round select. Now, using the hat control keys, I can move to all these different levels here uh, for what this is. You know, I don't know what all the differences are. Oh, here we go. So that's one versus three. Nothing said there. I'm just looking at that appears there. All right, so let's try this one versus three, and let's do Lakeside. You know, it's some of the Japanese, eh? Because there's so much Japanese, it makes you think, yeah, we've got to figure it out. But, yeah, we'll see whether this is against computer opponents or whether it wants to go online. I think this is purely computer opponents, so it will go quick. There we go. Oh, here we are. All right, so I think it wants us to come third here. So a lot of these cars look the same. So that's a you know, that car there I think is a drone type car, as is that one. But then they start to mix it up a little bit with different versions. But you know, essentially, let's try get third, which is what it's asking for. And that guy on the left hand side there, he's asking you to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Thank you very much. Come on, come on. Come on. And after this go, we are going to have a look at the time trial as well, just to show you what that's all about. Oh, slow, slow, slow. There we go. There was a lot of break in there, so I didn't uh, take number seven from behind. And it's a good job we didn't, because if there'd been a car in front of him that he'd been rammed into, number seven would have suddenly been spit roasted, spit roasted by two cars. Down. But yeah, this is just outstanding to look at, in my opinion. And it's fun as well, it is generally fun. Oh, great, lots of great old spits. That nearly went wrong, that nearly went very wrong. Right, here we are going for third place. And we take it, we take third place. Obviously, if you're playing against real players, you're going to be in a world where the gameplay is going to be a lot more vicious from the other cars. You know, that, that goes without question. But you know what? You can still have fun playing in off ride mode like this gives us. Oh, it liked that lap time, didn't it? Oh, it really liked that lap time. Oh. Oh, bugger. Yeah, the braking looks so good as well. I just thought I'd quickly show you that. Look at these lights. Oh, damn it. Stupid, stupid. Finish! Finish. Oh, I failed. I don't think I got third, which is what I think it wanted me to do. I have no idea what it's saying there. Yeah, look at us. Failed. Alright, so we go to the top menu again. And we're now going to show you this time attack. And who shall we pick for this? That one? Let's do this one. Have a good race. So this is a time show where you're just racing, I believe, um, against your own time. So I've had a, a bit of a play with this. I can't remember what all the options were. 
But I mean, the deal of that car is just phenomenal. Yeah, so it's us, ourselves, and God, the big guy upstairs. But we haven't even crossed the start line yet. It allows us to do this to pick up some super, super speed. Look, they're, they're Dunlop. There you go, Dunlop tyres, Michelin Man. You know, those are names from the past. Do we have Michelin here as well? We've certainly got Dunlop. Did Michelin pay Sega any money to do this? But the rat. Oh, oh, shit! Okay, right, okay, there was a lot of time lost there. Okay, so yeah, how much sponsorship can you see as we race around this track? If I can get the wrong file for it, I think the next racing game we will be doing is the new version of Daytona that is also available on the Techno Parrot emulator. Now, if you're still with us, thank you, thank you very much. I would appreciate if you could sign up to the Discord as well. The link for that is in the video description. That also you know, it's helping me grow the channel a little bit. You know, so far, there's a few people in there. Thank you to each and every one of you that have signed up so far. It's brutally, brutally young. It's almost a virgin Discord. In fact, it is a virgin Discord. But be one of the founder members of the Discord channel by signing up. And, you know, that would be absolutely awesome. I really, really appreciate that if you could do that for me. So this is rather a long track, isn't it? I'd screwed up in the beginning, but there we go. So let's try and get 10 seconds off this. Right, so I'm trying to get this down to 120 effectively on the next track that we do. Because it's time trials. It is time trials. And then what we do, we're going to do lap number three, probably in silence, because I'll see whether I can actually get any better time um, than what I got on this lap. But now the car, the car controls are really, really well in this game. If, if, if I'd had a chance to play this in the arcade, um, I think I'd have enjoyed it. I really do. You know, perhaps not so much against human opponents because they would have destroyed me. You know, they, they, they would have butchered me in the racing. But against what it gives you as default, yeah, this is good. This is fun. I'm, I'm just playing against myself, but obviously... Oh, oh, shit, it's that corner again. I'm just playing against myself with regard to... You know, the, the, the time trolls that you're looking to do. But we lost valuable seconds on that corner. I do hope that we're going to beat 132. Obviously, this would be so much better if you had a wheel as well. If you had a real steering wheel to do this. Oh my not! Oh my god! Oh, we did. We did by, by a couple of seconds. I thought we would have been so much better than that. Really? I know this was meant to be a silent lap, but oh my god. You know, that, that I thought was a reasonably good drive that we did. But clearly, clearly not. Nice, easy, straight. Well, we're halfway round this bloody track. Oh, no, no. There was a little flash up there as we went across the S2, if you look at the map on the left-hand side. It kind of indicated that we might be doing better than we were before. And then I hit all that bloody gravel and sand and crap. Yeah. We're point eight nine four. Um, worse off now. Bugger. 
God, it's the tightest of margins. It really, really is. All I can do is hold the accelerator down. Hold the accelerator down and hope we are going to make this. No. No, we didn't. Balls to that. Balls to that. Yeah, so the middle lap was our best lap. All right, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna do one more thing. We're gonna go to the top menu and we're gonna have a race in one of the really pretty Team looking select. cars. I think this changes car. Team select. There you go, look at that for all your anime people. You know, how cool is this car? Let's do one more race in here. All right, and we'll go here. In fact, no, we'll go back. Oh no, we won't. I pushed the wrong button, damn it. Alright, so what I'm doing now while it's waiting is if I push uh, effectively what is the yellow button, he does that. And there was a way. How, how do we move them? There you go. Right, let's try and make uh, the black guy come up. Oh, there's the red one. Okay, alright, so I seem to only make s some of them come up there. But it doesn't matter. The black guy was uh, that one on the bottom left hand side with the electrified writing that he's doing. Alright, the final race, the final race of this game. Let's see what we can do. Engine Starto. Yes, start your engines. See, I speak Japanese. Here we go, here we go. I've said this before on videos, I'm always intrigued how with some Japanese games you get such a mix of English and Japanese thrown in. You know, there's just enough English here that makes this um, playable. I had a dream last night, I've just remembered one of my dreams and it involves driving and I got a speeding ticket in my dream and you know in all the years of driving I've cursed myself now, I have never ever got myself a speeding ticket, oh I've tried so much, I've spent so much on the roads but no I've never managed to get one, uh, but yeah I had a dream last night that I got a speeding ticket and I was a bit disappointed in myself. Um, you know, look at the back of this car, we're going to break quickly here with the lights, there you go. All the cars have very, very different designs that you see here as we're playing in this anime car. I mean, look at that on the hood, you know, that, that, that view, you know, you know what, we'll, we'll go to this view, I think, for the remainder of this game. So you can see a frightened, I, I have no idea what character that is, um, but a frightened anime girl's looking face as she hurtles towards uh, the rear end of any car. Alright, okay. So we're in second position at the moment. We know we've got one car just behind us as well. We can see him there. There they are. Oh, there again. Won't be doing that too often. Oh, look at that. He's driving us. He's driving us. Maybe it's like in F1. Maybe you get multiple cars uh, from the same teams. And here we go, here we go. This is where we start to overtake some of the drone cars. Oh, close. So these are cars that we would have already overtaken. God, they're not very fast, are they? And that really, really helps us because it gives us more distance between the, the people that are trying to overtake our position by getting in the way there. And we finished. So yeah, you, 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 can, you can create a, a cluster sandwich where you feel loads of drone cars between you and essentially second and third to hopefully, hopefully help you win. 
でしょうか You know what? We ain't gonna watch all of this because by the time some of those other cars come in, you know, I would say that they are over a lap behind. And you can see, look at this, 15 seconds after that. You know, three seconds after that. Well, while this comes in, let's just s t talk him. You know, if there's stuff you want to see us play on this channel, we do do requests if we feel the game is gonna, you know, be the kind of game that we play on this channel. So, you know, don't be shy, don't be shy. And, oh, he didn't show us all of it. Damn it, it timed out. Look at that, look at that. So, yeah, that shows us our position in there. And I think that brings us to. The end of this video. So I hope、oh, that was a bit of loud noise there before it went. You know, that was another screen appearing. So yeah, I hope you really, really enjoyed this video. This is something a little bit different that we've done. And Techno Parrot, thank you. Thank you guys for all your hard work to bring this to people like me, people at home. Really, really appreciate your time and effort. Beyond that, all of you stay safe. All of you take care. And I'll see you in the next video.